children today in this session we are going to learn about letter writing the classification of letter rules format and a sample letter all these topics are going to be discussed in this class first we will see the classification of uh, letters the types of letters informal letter writing that is the letters to friends and relatives are called as informal letter writing then what is the formal letter writing business letter and official letter uh, or both are called as formal letter writing so business letter means used by traders firm, firms and companies official letter writing communication of information by government officials from one department to another and also to other companies next to see what is the format of the uh, uh, formal letter first one sender's info that is sender's address the next one date the third one receiver's info receiver's address and a designation then fourth one salutation fifth one body of the letter and the sixth one closing that is called a subscription also then signature okay yes first date date should include the month date and year date can be written in three forms we can write in the three forms also march 6th 2014 or 2020 that is a sample is given here 6th march 2014 and 6th march so you can write um, you can choose any one format here while writing the date date is placed on the left hand side next one inside address that is uh, the receiver's address uh, the inside address is the uh, recipient's address the receiver's courtesy title miss or mrs or mr or miss or doctor so whatever engineer whatever it may be second uh, line receiver's name then receiver's professional title then department and company's name then receiver's address yes dear then how to be the uh, salutation this is the greeting with which every letter begins the customary greeting in business letter is dear sir others or dear madam for both single and married women we can write madam dear sirs when a partnership is addressed that is more than uh, one or two um, head is there we can write dear sirs okay next one basic body style how should be the body of the letter Plan your letter in advance and keep it simple. First part of the body. State the purpose of the letter. For, for what purpose you are writing this letter? It should be in the introductory part, introductory paragraph. Second part of the body. State your point. Explain what you want to happen. Explain the information you have. You have a lot of information. Break it. Make short paragraphs. List the points or include it as an attachment. So, for, for what purpose you are writing? What is your uh, reason to write this letter? You have to make it as a small paragraph and write it in the second part. Then third part third part of the body call for action or request some from uh, form of action what to do and when to do it what is what repair or replacement so what you want what is the solution you have to write it in the third part thank the reader for his or her response in the third part it seems you have to write that um, reader um, thank the reader in the third part you have to add that also in the third part. So, uh, basic body style of the uh, letter should be in three paragraphs. Okay, yes. Next one, subscription or complimentary closing. It marks the end of the letter. It contains certain courteous words. Use of these courteous words depends upon the tone or nature of the letter, whether it is a formal or informal letter. Based on that, you can choose the subscription. Formal letter means how you have to write. Informal letter means how you have to write here. You are sincerely, you are truly, you are faithfully. That is a formal letter means you can choose these things. Informal letters means that is a personal letter you can write to your uh, close relatives or um, friends means you can write yours lovingly like that. Okay, yes. 
then a complaint letter some sample letter is given here see there how you have to write this first one sender name sender sender name you can write it or uh, that is option optional only okay sender's title or position sender's organization name sender street address and city state zip code pin code what is that then date then recipient's name that is receiver's name recipient's position or title recipient's organization name recipient street address city state zip code means that is pin code then salutation dear sir or madam then the body of the letter they have given here some sample i am writing this letter to bring your attention that i am not satisfied with your quality of service provided at you can uh, write that business name what the name is given in the question you can uh, take it and write it here i am taking about the service to con date date you can write the date and want to let you know i was very upset with your staff's performance they used to, to deal with me quite inefficiently and did not show their interest which they must show while dealing with regular customers the, the, here they are giving the regret what is the reason for that i have been a regular client of your business but now i completely disappointed i expect quality services from you and request you to address this issue with immediate attention i expect full compensation and look forward to your replies with shortest time this is a replacement or solution or uh, what is the remedy you have to write it in the third paragraph then here subscription yours sincerely write your name here okay yes i hope you understood this uh, letter writing and we will meet in the next class until then bye from your english teacher bye dear